Welcome to IQ Checker YouTube channel, home of science quizzes and IQ tests. This is a continuation of lower secondary checkpoint science sample paper 1. Kindly check the playlist for more. Question 9. Jamila makes 5 sounds. She looks at the trace each sound makes on an oscilloscope. The traces are labeled A, B, C, D, and E. Look at trace A. Complete the sentences. Choose from B, C, D, or E. Question 9A. Which sound is louder than A? To answer this set of questions, trace A is given as a reference wave to which all the other traces are to be compared. So in sound wave, there is what is called amplitude as indicated in trace A. Amplitude is the maximum distance moved by a point on a wave. The higher the amplitude, the greater the loudness of the sound. So the only trace with higher amplitude than trace A is trace B. So trace B will be the loudest. Question 9B. Which sound has a higher frequency than A? To answer this question, it will be good to know what frequency is all about and derive the frequency for each trace. So frequency of a wave refers to how often the particles of the medium vibrate when a wave passes through the medium. It is measured as the number of complete back and forth vibrations of a particle of the medium per unit of time. So back to trace A. The green line is one frequency and the blue line is also one frequency. So trace A has two frequencies. The frequency for trace B and trace C are also two. Trace D is one frequency and trace E has four frequencies. So the sound with a higher frequency than A is trace E. Question 9C. Which two sounds have a different pitch to A? To answer this question, you should know that the pitch of a sound depends on the frequency. So the sounds with different pitch to trace A are the sounds with different frequencies. They are sound D and E, having 1 and 4 respectively. Question 10. Azan investigates the reaction between 0.5 gram of sodium carbonate and 20 cm cube of dilute hydrochloric acid. Azan measures the reaction time, the time it takes for the reaction to stop. He did five different experiments, uses a different concentration of acid in each experiment, keeps the temperature the same in each experiment. The results of the experiment are shown. In the table. Question 10a. Plot Azan's result on the grid. Draw the curve of best fit through the points. We'll be provided with a page with grid lines to answer questions like this. Now use the table of results to plot the graph. Mark points of concentration against the corresponding reaction time. 0.5 against 68, 1 against 40, 1.5 against 24, 2.0 against 14, and finally 2.5 against 10. The next thing is to draw a curve of best fit, not straight line. So you should have something similar to mine. Note, always use a well-sharpened pencil when plotting and drawing. Question 10b. Describe the trend shown by these results. From the table of results on the graph, we can observe that 1. The higher the concentration, the shorter the reaction time. 2. The higher the concentration, 
the faster the reaction. Question 11, which is the last question in sample paper 1. Oliver investigates conduction of thermal heat energy. He heats a metal rod. The metal rod has a pin attached with wax. Oliver measures the time it takes before the pin falls off the rod. The pin takes 45 seconds before it falls. 11a. Describe how Oliver makes his results more reliable. So Oliver can make his experimental results more reliable by repeating the experiment. The more you repeat, the more reliable the experimental result. Question 11b. Oliver does a risk assessment for his investigation. He considers the safety hazards. Describe two of the safety hazards in Oliver's investigation. So this question has to do with safety hazards and these are risks to be avoided. These risks include 1. Risk of getting burned when the apparatus gets hot. 2. Risk of getting skin wound from the sharp pains and three risk of the wax catching fire. So these are safety hazards that need to be avoided. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and click the bell button for notifications. Thank you.